Hey, good morning, Pop. How are you? you ready to get up? Two, three. Oh, oh, oh. I remember uh, always looking at my dad's arms. He had arms like Popeye, because you know he was a tugboat captain and he was doing all this hard work on the water. And I so admired his physique, you know. And, and now it's, it's a different story, you know. And that's just the way it is. The role reversal was scary, but it was very humbling to take him and to change his clothes and to give him a shower. And it's the kind of thing that you do out of love because he took care of me when I was a kid, too. When I shave my dad, it, it becomes difficult. It's just you don't know how much pressure you're putting on someone. You don't know what angle to do it at. I worry about cutting him. I, I, I just wish there was something that I could use that would just be a lot easier to deal with. In 2016, Gillette designed the first ever razor solely for assisted shaving. The first step was rethinking ergonomics. Going away from the traditional inward-facing stick handle and going to an outward-facing divot, which operates like a paintbrush, allowing for a more intuitive feel. The second was a high-quality single blade that could be dispensed with after one shave. The third step was a built-in skin prep that prepares vulnerable skin for a shave but makes a difficult move to the bathroom unnecessary. This new design is an answer to a simple question. How can we help? What more can we do to make sure that every man no matter his circumstances, can be the best he can be. I'm one of the lucky ones. A lot of my friends my age do not have their dads. And I still have my dad. He, he looks up at me after I pour love on him for the whole day. And he says, I don't know what I did to deserve you. And I say, Dad, I got you. I got you, Dad. <laughs>